The Cambridge University Herbarium is part of the Department of Plant Sciences. It is located in the basement of the Sainsbury Laboratory, within the grounds of the Cambridge University Botanic Garden. A herbarium is a collection of dried plants that are usually attached to a sheet of paper. Once dried, plant specimens are stable for several hundred years, so they make great vouchers for future study. What makes herbarium specimens so interesting is that we don't just have the plants themselves, we also have information about where they were collected, when and by whom. It means that we can use herbaria as a giant archive of plant diversity. They help us identify plants, track the geographical distribution of species through time, and assess whether species are at risk of extinction, among countless other things. We can even extract DNA from them, to study how plant groups are related to each other. The Cambridge University Herbarium contains an estimated 1.1 million specimens from all over the world. Our oldest known specimen dates back to 1703, and our most recent was collected only a few months ago, here in Cambridge. All of our specimens have a story, some of them more famous than others. We house the plants that Charles Darwin collected on the voyage of the Beagle, for example. This one is actually an extinct species of the cucumber family. If Darwin hadn't collected it, preserved it, and deposited it in a herbarium, we wouldn't even know it ever existed. And we don't just have flowering plants. The University Herbarium also houses mosses, ferns, and seaweeds. We also have a small fungarium that contains dried mushrooms, lichens, and samples of plant diseases from the 19th century. In addition to specimens, our collections include thousands of gorgeous botanical illustrations. These artworks were used by botany professors, such as John Stevens Henslow, to teach botany at the university. Some of them were also commissioned to illustrate the description of species that are new to science. In recognition of the outstanding scientific and historical value of the collections, the Cambridge University Herbarium was awarded designated status by the Arts Council in 2022. Our main mission is to facilitate the use of our collections for research and education. Each year, we accommodate hundreds of requests from researchers and students in the fields of life sciences and humanities. We provide images of specimens and information about our collection. We also welcome researchers who want to examine the collections in person. We supervise student research projects and provide training on plant collecting and other related topics.